Let's go! Bitcoin has broken $50,000 and is currently trading at above $51,500 US dollars. It is normal for the altcoins to suffer when Bitcoin is making one of these big moves. But here's the thing, there's nothing to worry about because we are still in a bull market. And as I said, it's very normal for the altcoins to go sideways or go down a bit while all of the spotlight is on Bitcoin. And that also means that since we're seeing a dip right now among the altcoins, that may be a good opportunity to load up on those quality altcoins. And that is why today we are going to take a look at Cosmos, which could be one of the best performing altcoins as we continue forwards in this bull run. Usually when people discuss what the most popular base layer protocol for the future of crypto will be, they usually mention Ethereum, they mention Polkadot, and obviously they mention Cardano. However, Cosmos is a seriously underestimated competitor to the coins on that list. Not only is Cosmos positioned for success because of its function as a base for interoperability, but a huge update is coming to the Cosmos ecosystem that will make it an extremely attractive system to develop on or for any blockchain project to move on to. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe so you can stay up to date on all of the most important crypto news and the best coins to invest in. Guys, let's get straight into it. The approach Cosmos has taken towards solving the puzzle of blockchain interoperability is different than pretty much any other project. So let's get started with an overview of how Cosmos actually plans to become the internet of blockchains. Cosmos has two different types of interoperability. First, there are the blockchains that are actually built on top of the Cosmos network. These chains are usually developed through the software development kits provided by Cosmos and are able to easily communicate with any other blockchain built on top of Cosmos. The other type of interoperability is what allows the blockchains within the Cosmos ecosystem to communicate with chains outside of the ecosystem, such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, Polkadot, and many others. This two-sided approach comes with a variety of benefits. First of all, the reality is that there will almost certainly never be an ecosystem that becomes the base for every other blockchain project to be built on top of. This is because there will always be projects that will create their own standalone blockchains either because they need to, to fit the specific needs of the project, because they do not want to be able to be influenced by any other projects or for some other reason. Basically, the bottom line is this, if you want to become a major player in the operability space, you need to be able to communicate with chains outside of your native network. On the other hand, it is very helpful for the projects that do not need to create their own standalone blockchain to be able to use the software development kits or SDKs provided by Cosmos. Using those SDKs, a project can create a blockchain on the Cosmos network very quickly, and that chain receives a large number of benefits from being built on top of Cosmos. Okay, so you can see a bunch of those benefits listed here. Some of the highlights are that any chains built on Cosmos come with built-in interoperability. They are proof of stake, and they have a basic form of governance that can be used to allow token holders to vote on changes and upgrades. Now, let's talk about the big update coming to Cosmos. The update is called Stargate and it will be arriving in less than a day, as you can see on this countdown timer. Cosmos is calling Stargate the biggest event in the ecosystem since the launch of the Cosmos hub itself, and for good reason. This is because for the first time ever, Cosmos blockchains will be able to connect with each other using the first standardized protocol for inter-blockchain communication. With the standardized IBC protocol comes a lot of significant performance upgrades. These upgrades include increasing the efficiency of blockchains built with the Cosmos SDKs by 100x, making the process of syncing a full node 96 times faster, and making upgrades to the chains 20 times faster. The upgrades not only make the blockchains built on Cosmos faster, but also expand the possibilities of what they can be used for. First of all, it gives communities the ability to build new economic instruments, now allows any small group of people to launch a fast blockchain and connect it to a global ecosystem. This is truly a huge step towards providing global access to blockchain technology. Another benefit is that IBC is supported by a growing number of open source blockchain frameworks, all written in different programming languages. This means that a far greater number of developers will be able to create projects in the Cosmos ecosystem without needing to learn a new programming language. 
This will help to draw in talent as well as speed up growth and adoption. Last, but definitely not least, IBC allows for the creation of new tokens, protocols, cryptography, and other financial instruments on the Cosmos network. All of the things are core parts of decentralized finance. As we have seen on Ethereum, DeFi can bring explosive growth to an ecosystem as it is perhaps the most widely hyped sector in all of cryptocurrency right now. Combining DeFi with the interoperability, quickness and ease of use of Cosmos, it is easy to see how Cosmos could become a rival to any other base layer protocol that exists. As with any other projects that we look at as a potential investment, we must look at the tokenomics for the Cosmos token, which goes by the ticker of Atom. Right now, Atom has a market cap of $4.9 billion, which makes it the 16th largest cryptocurrency. That is a significant amount of money already, but as we have learned in the past, if a project provides an important service of a place of other projects to build, they can see huge growth regardless of how large they already are. For example, if you just take a look at Ethereum, we will see that it is worth $204 billion. Even if Cosmos only became worth half as much as Ethereum at some point in the future, that would be more than a 20x from the current price of Atom. It is also important to note that there is more money flowing into cryptocurrency investments than ever before, and a lot of that money is from institutional investors. Unlike a lot of retail investors, it is only feasible for institutional investors to invest in projects that are already worth billions, simply because of the amount of money they have and they are willing to put into the crypto space. As I have talked about in previous videos, one of the most popular methods for these institutional investors to invest in crypto is through Grayscale Trusts. What is interesting is that at the end of January, Grayscale registered to create a Cosmos Trust. While the trust is not active and there is no guarantee that it ever will be, the registration did show that they are considering the option and could anticipate demand for it in the future. With the Stargate update being implemented on the 18th, it would not be surprising for the demand to start building, not just among the super wealthy, but also among retail investors like us. Moving back to tokenomics, you do need to be aware that Atom is inflationary, meaning that it does not have a set supply cap. Atom tokens are earned as rewards through staking to secure the network. While in the long term this will affect the value of the Atom token, it is not likely to be a factor in the price movements in the short to mid term, meaning that it is not something you need to worry about if you are just going to buy as a swing trade or to hold for this bull run. A good thing about Atom is that because Cosmos uses proof of stake, a lot of Atom is locked up in staking to earn the rewards. To be specific, 66% of the total supply is currently staked. This decreases the amount of Atom available for purchase which helps to drive up demand. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to be on the lookout for the next altcoin gems, make sure to subscribe to this channel right now. And also, let's talk a bit about NFTs. It's popping up in the middle of this video. Watch it. I will see you right there.